name is Barbara Bullard and I'm a professor of communication studies at Orange Coast College. I teach a class called Communications 100 where people learn to communicate with themselves first and then with other people in group work and then how to stay out of family arguments, what to do on family dynamics and it's a very popular course at OCC. My class is very brain based. Brains are changing, they're being rewired. Uh, the millennials are exciting to teach because they are so creative. Every day of my life I wake up to be the best person I can be and I try and bring my full egg game into every class I teach. I travel around the world. I think that that was a really great thing to have for me because I learned to accept people of every culture bringing people to their self-worth has been a life passion since I started teaching. Finding yourself is a whole life's journey. It's not a destination. When you get to a higher state of meditation, it's a very ecstatic kind of a place. Sometimes it's very restful type. Sometimes I get advice. That's always been a really interesting thing. For me, the first six months of meditation was very difficult for me. It was challenging. I didn't think anybody could calm their mind for that long. But then one time, my husband-to-be was playing music before meditation, and I felt myself lifted up out of my body and just want like one with the cosmos. It was the most blissful thing I'd ever experienced. And that kept me meditating for a long time before I had the second blissful experience. So. Finding the blissful experiences is not the goal of meditation. Meditation is many, many different goals, particularly physical for me, health-wise, and then ultimately, sometimes, the ecstasy occurs. So I am actually a Reiki master. You know how I use a lot of hand gestures. I'm actually sending out energy. I don't actually teach meditation in my advanced class. I have a guru come in and teach meditation, which is very exciting. The students think he's like Jesus. Most people after my classes do change. Every student is different. Some students just just blossom by the time they end the semester, and other times it takes six months later for the students to start to apply the principles. Each of us is a totally unique person who's done.